Down the ice place while we roll up a blunt And me and Jack will get stony Walk around and get lost Don't think I'll ever truly pay back All I was lucky to get Just by walking through the city No, I'm a small part of this Hey y'all, we are at the school Look at my baby Say hi, booty I was gonna try to let y'all see my fit for the day But I don't know how y'all gonna do it Oh, it's so good in here. Your phone? Mm -hmm. You left your phone? Oh my bad. I told you to get it. Why you didn't get it? I, I had no game sheet. Baby boy is at the playground. City of mine. How I love, how I love the city of mine. It never gets me down. City of mine. Raised on its edges, my pop work is life when it's calm box up on love in its center. If I could live here forever, think it'd be for the better. I love the weather, even though it's fog 24-7. I love the people. This is city I met all my best friends, and I wanna thank every break. I wanna thank every entrance to every building that I step in in this city of mine. I owe you most my best moments in life. See, I fell in love for the first time in Golden Gate Park I saw my first rap show at Great American Hall I used to beg my homies for a ride across the bridge to goof off And spend the whole damn day doing whatever we want Keek drove us down the ice place while we roll up a blunt And me and Jack would get stony, walk around and get lost Don't think I'll ever truly pay back all I was lucky to get Just by walking through the city, no, I'm a small part of this getting his weight and everything done guys 
I'm just sitting here relaxing and you know, it's so hot outside. I wear oh, they do smell so fast in here. Cause I ain't want my I'm gonna get the home. I'm lay down. Go hit it. Lay down. You want to take a nap? I'm gonna let y'all know that he um he what's the name? He camping right now. He's really camping, guys. He really, really don't want to take a nap. He really wants to go home and play with his electronics. He's camping. Oh, okay. Well, don't go touching your electronics when you get home, okay? No, but see, <laughs> he's camping, guys. <laughs> Hello. Is Hello. this Ahmad? Yes, it is. I'm Dr. William, the senior resident pediatrician here in the clinic today. How are y'all doing? All right, how you doing? I appreciate you seeing us. Yeah, okay. and you are Ahmad? Yes, I am Ahmad. Okay. So let me just get the computer set up. And this is Ahmad's nine-year-old checkup, correct? Yes. And I was just looking through the chart and he had one video visit during the lockdown and pandemic and everything, but it looks like he's otherwise very healthy during this. Oh, it, yeah, I mean, yes, y'all. Okay, I'm gonna get his blood drawn when he's done. Mm -hmm. Oh, honey. And his vision and hearing were normal, mm -hmm. all past, mm -hmm. too. He told me she did a vision and hearing. You gotta find him a bathroom, you gotta get to go to the bathroom. Mm -hmm. See if the doctor's gonna give you a book today, because we like books. Yeah, I'll see if he's gonna give you a book today. There's the restroom right there. Go to the restroom, guys. Mm -hmm. So, the most important thing I have written here mm -hmm. is sort of the emphasis on making sure he's taking the controller two pops twice a day. Right. And then watch out for any of the following symptoms if he's coughing at night, if he gets out of breath early, mm -hmm. or if you're using the albuterol rescular inhaler mm -hmm. more than twice a week. Right. If he has any of those, those are signs that we can go up on his Dulera dosing and we want to get mm -hmm. his asthma under control before he has a flare, hopefully, right. and just give our office a call and we can go through some options. Okay. Then I've attached his school forms. Oh, here thank you. As well. I appreciate it. So guys, I didn't listen here too much about the virus, or what he was saying about the virus and stuff because uh, I don't know. I just turned the camera off. I don't want the video to be too long, but so I'll I'll tell you a little bit of what we talked about as far as the virus concern. Um, him going back to school, which was one of my um, um really big concerns as far as him going back to school. So he's testing because he has you know his severe asthma and. The vi viruses is what triggers his asthma. So we have to really, really be very careful now when he does go back to if and when he does go back to school. <coughs> My throat is getting dry, honey. Because you girl needs something to drink. But anyway, if and when he goes back to school guys, um we do need um to make sure that he Yes. Yeah, I remember election day. You remember election day? <laughs> and so we do really need to make sure that he just doesn't get sick. He continues to wash his hands constantly, you know. So y'all pray for me because viruses is what triggers his asthma. And his last asthma attack was in 2018, guys. But I know you probably said that was a while ago. It was the end, it was, yeah, like the end of 2018. And it was bad, guys. I'm just telling you, it was bad. And it was scary as heck, you know? And now I'm the only parent that he has to deal with that on my own, you know? I was so glad for um, his dad being there and for his support because it was scary and it was sad to see my baby sick. You know, when you're not used to seeing your kids like that all the time, it's hard, you know. And that's why my heart goes out to a lot of children who are sick with different diseases, cancer, and things of that nature, you know. So, um, just pray for me, guys. Just pray for me, pray for us, you know. 
means I decide what is best for him. All right, so I'll chat with you later, guys. I'll chat with you later. Let me do my dance, y'all. That's okay. I got him. Wait till I get outside in the street. I'm gonna say. No. <laughs> I know you lying. Y'all see him? I, I know he lying. Come on, boy. Hold on my clothes, man. You going? You going too far, boy? I could. You drink a lot of water to so see your blood be good. And she only get one stick.